This virus spreads through social contact, and so it's had a terrible impact on the hospitality sector, who in good times exist to encourage that very social contact that we all enjoy. So we've had to take difficult but necessary decisions to suppress the virus. Health Secretary Matt Hancock announced on Thursday restrictions in force in other parts of the region would be extended to Harleypool and Middlesbrough. Local leaders in the area have requested a government ministers to impose a household mixing ban instead of further restrictions to the hospitality industry. It's incredibly disappointing because all of the data we have shows that about 80% of our current cases are being transmitted through household visits and so it makes sense for us to tackle that issue and the only restriction we asked for was to limit household visiting until we were able to get a grip of it. What came back from the government unfortunately went way beyond that. Uh, it's going to have serious repercussions to our local economy and ultimately it's, it's going to cost jobs. We need to get cases back under control but um, similarly what I need from the government is a very, very clear exit strategy. Middlesbrough Mayor Andy Preston has refused to accept these new regulations and has been in regular contact with Hartlepool Council since the announcement. Not long after the uh, restrictions were put in place, uh, I had one local business owner um, call me up in tears because he just didn't see how his business was going to be able to to cope with these restrictions and since then we've had uh, another four businesses announce that they're going to have to close because they simply can't afford to operate under these uh, under these measures and this is the point and this is why andy and i are angry this isn't what we asked for this isn't what was needed and quite clearly the government isn't going to change that what they've imposed and so we're saying if you're not going to change it you certainly need to fund it